I think this map that you're looking at on the background is giving us a hint of the first look of what Olympus will look like once it drops. <laughs> So we've seen the first look at what the map will look like, we've seen what the trident, the vehicles will look like, those things were released on Twitter today and I will have them on the screen soon but first I want to discuss this little thing you're looking at right now, those tunnels, it's something that you can really pick up on when they start showing you little uh, images or color images from the releases. From the from whatever uh, footage they released on the map because some of it was really hard to see and it was like tinted blue or I don't know how they edited it but what as you can see a lot of it also goes back to the design of uh, the the training level the first training run run through that you had to do at the beginning of Titanfall which I should have images of right now on the screen uh, the, a lot of the designs or style of, uh, of the map, the map designing looks a lot like what we've been able to look at, especially on the Trident footage that was released just recently. You can you can basically see that the a lot of it obviously comes from Titanfall. I mean, it, the game is uh, essentially a uh, a branch of uh, Titanfall, and so. It's to no surprise that a lot of the levels have a ton of similarities when it comes down to uh, Titanfall. So, uh, one thing I do want to say is that there's this thing known as an arc and you can see it on the background, the thing that's spinning right now. The thing, there's a little spear in the center that is essentially powering the, the particular glove that I'm using at the moment to teleport back and forward into time if you didn't realize that that that's what's going on every time I use the glove or the glove comes out I'm jumping into the time just like I just did there and so one thing that you got to realize and that's the to um, to travel through time you actually need a lot of energy which is the only reason why it's almost impossible to time travel until we can figure it out how to sustain a massive amount of energy without blowing ourselves up and so for whatever reason that's what the horizon was working on and i'm pretty sure i'm almost certain that the reason the frontier war started was to acquire the technology that ash stole from horizon i know that it's not verified that ash was the one person that left horizon stranded in space for 87 years and if you guys don't understand well she was only there for a few months on her end however since she's near the horizon time works different and you could um, you could talk to Einstein about that or watch Interstellar to understand it but I'm not really gonna go into it that thing that you see the spear that you see in front of us right now that particular center of it is what most likely is they're using the crystal that Horizon created in order to power it uh, that's the reason why she wanted it created so that she'll have power because the city of Olympus was running out of energy and I'm pretty sure the people in charge of that were the syndicate which was the one hiring the predators which were a mercenary group led by your boy Bliss which is the one who is sponsoring the Apex games now it's no surprise that Horizon is gonna be a part of the games most likely to kind of have a little bit of revenge against Ash and Bliss and I can't wait to see the little interactions once uh, Horizon actually gets to the game however I know there are a lot of uh, speculations since it can't be verified and it's not like the devs are gonna find any of this information maybe tomorrow on the trailer release we might get a lot more information about this but as you can see the glove I'm holding on to right now gives me the ability to time travel and it's in one way or another powered by a crystal and I'm assuming that the crystal is what Horizon created that just me just kind of just reasoning with the fact that within the within the events that are happening on time to fall you gotta remember that at this point Horizon was essentially stuck in space so by the time she comes back it's been 20 years since the war ended but within those 80 something years that she spent stuck in space uh the the war happened literally the war broke out somewhere in between her 
literally retrieving the crystal and Ash stealing it from her. And I'm assuming it's no coincidence that the war started. Or the, there was a war that broke out somewhere like almost right after she created the crystal. And now we're going back to Olympus and the city seems to be back on its feet. It doesn't look destroyed as it seem um, as it seem on the images that she was looking at, which should be on the screen right now. She's looking at a giant spear, and I believe the spear has to be this this thing that you're looking at right now. Uh, there's a particular center within here that has to the essentially essentially it's called an arc. That's what is referred to in the Titanfall. The the energy source is known as an arc. I know that that's not what Horizon name it, and I don't think Horizon gave it a name, but that's what is known in the Frontier War time 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 timeline, I suppose. And so the, my speculation is the Olympus is this particular map where what you're looking at is taking place, and I'm assuming that the thing that we're trying to retrieve is the, the the thing known as an arc is the crystal the horizon created and the reason there's a war is because people are trying to get their hands on it i mean it could give you the ability to time travel you understand if you can time travel you can control the future so of course there'll be a war a war that is intended to get rid of anyone who could potentially use this and bear in mind keep in mind that not everyone is as smart as horizon because not everyone decided to figure out how to create this crystal and so there's only a handful of people that can actually create or give rise to a technology they can harness this particular source of energy and so it's likely they were just trying to take each other out and that's the reason they hired the mercenary group known as the predators which was led by bliss now, like I said, this is happening about 20 or so years before the Apex games. And Horizon, around this time, is still stuck in space. At this point, someone has already stolen the crystal from Horizon, which we are going to call this person Ash. And at this point, and at the, at the moment in the Apex Legends timeline, Horizon has finally made her way back home and realized, well, we're making our way to her home which is olympus so yeah i think that that's gonna be really important because it's not that she's going to world's edge we are going to olympus we are going to meet with her and we should probably find out a little more or how the titanfall universe start intertwining with what the apex lore has come to be and so that's pretty much it for me to saw my two cents on the conversation horizon was the reason the frontier war started or broke out and i think that she, she i mean she missed the whole thing she was stuck 87 years in, for it for she was stuck for 87 years in space and now she's uh she's out of space back to her hometown and we're making our way there and so i can't wait to see the trailer tomorrow but if you're as excited as i am don't forget to hit a like and if you like to stay updated on everything in Apex, don't forget to subscribe. This is One Time Play here, signing out. Peace!